All right, gentlemen, this is an emergency alert. Uh, I know you all think you know why I called you here today, but in reality, you don't. So sit down, brace yourselves. It's about to get really serious because I have some important, frankly, damning information about Canada. Now, of course, as you all know, I am literally a genius, an actual genius. In fact, probably the only genius on the planet. Now, of course, obviously, there's other geniuses, but compared to my intellect, they look like fucking stupid children sucking on their own penises. So obviously, I'm a genius. So that means you can trust me when I share this information with you. All right. Now, me and a special team of me have been using our uh, our new technology to start a weed them out, all right? We're on a weenie hunt. We know how to weed them. This new technology is called Plague Incorporated, all right? Maybe you've heard of it. Uh, it's a popular, popular, popular phone game where you kill the whole planet. Well, for the past month, I have been attempting to beat Plague Incorporated on the hardest difficulty. Now, being the pro gamer that I am, obviously, I've almost done this several times, but last night was the closest I've come to completely eradicating the whole world with a disease that I geniusly called Romeo. Romeo was sweeping across the planet, toppling nation after nation, but there was one area of the world that was still resisting despite the disease's incredibly powerful uh, killing capacity and infectiveness. These regions were, of course, Greenland, Iceland, Poland, and Canada. Canada. Now, I figured maybe that was just a coincidence that Canada was thrown in with the lot, but as things started to move along, I began to notice that you know, maybe it wasn't that coincidental, because after a few mutations and some endless onslaught, Poland fell. Yes. So did Iceland. Yes. And Greenland. Mm-hmm. And when my numbers, when my numbers of infected people started again climbing after I thought that I was surely defeated by the northern countries, um, I noticed that, yes, victory was close at hand. But goddamn Canada was still not being infected. Strange? Yes, it's strange. And as my disease finally toppled Poland, and Iceland, and Greenland, one nation remained. Fucking Canada, dude. Fucking Canada. And, uh, which country was, uh, making the cure, do you think? Hmm? That's right. Fucking Canada, bro. Fucking Canada made the cure when they were the last country left. Weird, isn't it? I didn't get a single person infected in Canada. America was in fucking ruins right to the south of it, you know? But for some reason... That, of course, left Canada to keep the cure to itself while the rest of the world burned, suffered, and died around them. They didn't even try to help. They didn't even try to help. Every country fell, but fucking Canada. And if that's not evidence enough, then, I mean, honestly, go fuck yourself. Because I've been saying for years that Canada is home to the fucking Illuminati. And if there's any group on this planet that uh, has the cure to, the, to any diseases that are killing us and would keep them for profit or for themselves, it'd be fucking Canada. So as the rest of the world crashed and burned, Canada sat there laughing, laughing at me, knowing that I was the one that caused this disease and that they were triumphant not over the rest of the world, but over me. And, I and I'm taking this shit personal. <laughs>